What's up everybody, it's your boy TGK here on TGK TV. Today we got a special little video right quick. I'm gonna show you my entire haul that I've been able to get this entire week that the AAC has been hosting for the Mavs clear and sell event that they've been having like a fan shop. So let's get straight into this haul. All right, like I said, I've been there three times this week. I went Monday, Wednesday, and then today or Friday and Saturday. I forgot, I, I went three times this week. All right, so let's get straight into some of the items I got. Besides this shirt, I got this shirt. A, a lot of these shirts, a lot of the items were 50 to 25% off, some even 70%. Some were like 10 bucks, 15 bucks. This was one of the $15 items. So quick little Luka Doncic shirt, 20, 15 bucks, whatever the case may be. Then I got this um, Richardson jersey in the Dallas Mavericks, I guess this was a city, the city jersey um, from a couple of seasons ago. I just wanted to, to at least say I had this, this jersey and uh, it was going for 450 bucks, but they had a $20 former player rack. So I went ahead and got this literally for 20 bucks, bro. Can't beat that. And uh, it's literally gonna be a hooping jersey for me. Ended up getting this little hat here for my little nephew, baby little nephew. Uh, I don't know if his head is big enough for this, but uh, pretty sure he's going to grow into it eventually. So I ended up getting him this. I think it was like five bucks. All right. Another jersey here. We got a Reggie Bullock statement jersey. This was part of the uh, $20, $20 former former player uh, bundles that they, they were having. Uh, so I was able to get a Reggie Bullock jersey that, that fit me and I've been able to play basketball on it. And then they also had the Dallas Mavericks uh, shorts that you can you can get. So as you can tell here, I have the Maverick sign on the side and even the, the inside lining is pretty, pretty dope. I believe these were the official shorts. The jersey, 20 bucks again, and I believe the shorts were about 20 as well or 15, something like that. Ended up getting my nephew another item here, the replica jersey and short set. So whenever he's old enough to fit this, bam, I already got him ready to be a Dallas Mavericks fan. Got me some uh, decals uh, to add to my laptop. So I'm gonna add some of this stuff to my laptop or any other item I could feel like I put this in, but definitely that, that Mavericks right here, that, that retro one, ooh, that was, that was dope. Like five bucks. All right, so the story behind this right here, it, it looks like the Retroplex shorts, but it is not. The thing is someone had them in their position and they put them back on a rack and I went ahead and took the chance to have to get these to be able to match the next item I was I'm going to show you. But yeah, man, uh, to basically get the Retroplex shorts for like 15 bucks or it looks like it, still of a deal there. All right, so now to match the, sh the shorts, right? I, I have yet to have a jersey of this player and it is embarrassing that I do not have a jersey of this player, but I finally got me a jersey of Luka Doncic I was deciding between the Slovenia jersey or the, the City edition, and that ended up getting me the uh, City edition Luka Doncic jersey. Uh, these were 50% off, so from what the retail was, 130, got it for 65 bucks. You can't beat that. So in addition to that, I ended up getting this hat as well. They had these hats there for 15 bucks, bro. So I copped that. Nice little hat to add to that. And then, last but not least, this dope ass jacket right here. I ended up getting the uh, Retroplex jacket as well. Just so dope. Mavericks logo on the back. This was going for 65 bucks as well. So yeah, man, so you end up seeing me at a Mavericks game. Just know I have enough stuff, enough Mavs gear to last me several seasons. Cause I've gone a very long time without having any kind of Mavs gear and uh, was able to come up on quite a bit of stuff at very affordable and cheap prices as opposed to what the retail was. Um, very thankful I could buy this stuff uh, coming back home now and being a, being able to go to the arena and just be more a part of uh, enjoying my team here in Dallas. So yeah, man, this was the haul I got from the Mavs fan shop that they've been hosting this week here in the AAC. Today was the last day. So uh, if you're watching this now and thinking they were still going, they are not. But uh, yeah, man, let me know what you think of that haul. 
It's been your boy TGK. I'll catch y'all in the comments and catch y'all on the next one. We out.